There is another very useful modifier that you put at the end of the regular expression, which is the x. That enables spaces and comments in your regular expression. Now, normally, if you put a space in a regular expression, that would match a space. But once you put an x at the end here of the regular expression, you can split up your regular expression, spread it out in multiple lines, have spaces, and even add comments to the regular expression. And Perl will disregard all the new lines, all the spaces, and all these comments in your regular expression. So basically this regular expression is the same as this one. Now in this example maybe it's not that obvious because this is a short example, a simple regular expression. But when you have a larger ex uh, regular expression it uh, can be very hard to read. So it's uh, much nicer if you can spread it into multiple lines and then put comments explaining what kind of things each part uh, should match, maybe even providing examples of uh, what the, those things match, but um, and then, then it will make it a much more readable, much nicer uh, to have that regular expression, just put the x uh, at the end. If you want to ma match a space, uh, then probably the best uh, is to use a backslash s, which matches not only spaces, but tabs as well, so maybe it's not exactly the same, depending on what is good for you. Uh, you could also create, a, that's a bit, little bit of awkward, but you can create a regular um, character class, uh, which only has a single space in it, so a square bracket with a space in it, and that would uh, match correctly.